Yes, golden doodles are clever, but they are also funny, goofy, and let's face it, quirky. Here's what it's like for me to live with one. I think many golden doodle owners will relate. Hi, I'm Joanna and here is Sophie and this is my golden doodle diary. I make videos about golden doodle dogs, also known as groodles. If you're fascinated by this breed too, consider subscribing to this channel and join the conversation. Oh, these golden doodles, they can be very human-like. No wonder they form such powerful bonds with us. They look you in the eye, hold that gaze, and you honestly get hypnotized into thinking they're a real person. A sweet, funny, sometimes naughty, but always adorable person. Here are some of the ways they make themselves so endearing to us. I first saw this when Sophie was a puppy and thought it was the oddest and cutest thing. Her playing, relaxing and sleeping upside down. I thought I'd capture it on camera and I did. Over and over and over again. Did I mention I often run out of space on my phone camera? Sophie photos and videos just like these. It never gets old. But is it her just being cute when Simon and I are around? Nope. She lies upside down like this, all on her own, even when nobody's looking, making herself fully comfortable. It turns out this upside down thing is more common than not with other golden doodles too. If you have a golden doodle, I'm pretty sure your camera is filled with similar photos. With those golden doodle looks and that charm, Sophie's a bit of a people magnet when I take her out and about. I often feel like I'm minding a beloved celebrity who just must meet new people and make instant friends. Children love meeting her, Women stop and pat her. Interestingly enough, so do men of all ages. That was a surprise for me because I thought kids and women are more likely to be drawn to cute fluffy dogs. It turns out the canine teddy bear has universal appeal. Sophie immediately melts any ice when meeting strangers, sharing some of that golden doodle magic which lights people's faces up. People may just smile as they are passing by, or they may stop and chat for a minute or maybe more. In return, Sophie gets her attention, which makes her beam even more, which makes people smile with their eyes and hearts. The conversations, usually about Sophie, are always positive and uplifting. It's phenomenal, and I know it isn't just Sophie. There's something so approachable about golden doodles. I think they can show us the way to overcome our own barriers. Did you ever have any idea how simply wonderful running around is? If you have a golden doodle dog, there's a big chance you know all about the sudden circular sprinting bursts called zoomies. Sophie would run like the wind with all her enthusiasm, with all her might. I'm pretty sure she actually smiles as she runs. With her slender body, it looks like she's a little fluffy greyhound doing what comes naturally. It's a sight to behold, especially when she has other furry company. And that's it for today. I hope this video brought a bit of joy to your heart because in their own wonderful way, that's what golden doodles are for. What are some other golden doodle quirks you know of? Let me know in the comments below. Sophie and I wish you a beautiful day and we look forward to your company again very soon. Bye for now.